You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey, General Hospital fans, Belinda from Soap Dirt here, and it sure looks like we are edging closer to a potential Jason Morgan, Carly Spencer reunion. I know there are some fans cheering the idea of them getting together while others want Jason with someone else entirely. Everybody's got an opinion on who he should be with. But with Drew Kane dumping Carly, to me, it looks like the path has been cleared for a Jarly romance. If they go there, though, I have five huge questions that I want answers to. Let's dive into these questions. But first, please click subscribe if you haven't. So just off the bat, I want to address a couple of things. I told you guys there was not going to be a jailhouse reunion scene on Tuesday between Sam and Jason. There is this interlinked group of websites owned by the same people. They make up stuff. They label it spoilers. And they were so far off the mark with this. And a lot of people believed it. And they were looking forward to this Sam and Jason showdown slash reunion thing on Tuesday. And of course, it's not coming. They took the Jason gets a visitor spoiler and knitted together a piece of fan fiction But the truth is, on Tuesday, Willow is the visitor. She comes to see Jason in the boathouse, where I said he would still be on Tuesday, not in jail. To be clear, I think it's okay to discuss what might happen, what you hope happens, what you'd like to see happen, but don't call it a spoiler. Spoilers come from the network. They're official. They're not opinion or speculation. Just saying. My 411. So the other thing I want to address before we jump into this potential Jason Carly reunion is another insane article I read about Jason coming back with an FBI girlfriend. This other website pulled a random name from the past. They looked for somebody, some woman who worked for the FBI among all the 60 years of General Hospital we've had, and they found something. But it's so old, so out of date. The actress isn't even a working actress anymore. She quit years ago. Nobody remembers this character. I didn't even remember it. It was such a desperate grab just to have something to say. Nobody cares about it. There's so many ladies in Port Charles that Jason could get with. So why bring in some FBI woman? I don't see it happening. Anyway, my five big questions, if they are indeed reuniting Jason and Carly. Number one, can Jason get with Carly but still work with Sonny? Of course, once all this you know mob assassin stuff is over. Back in the day... When Carly and Sonny were together, Jason was besties with them both and basically a third wheel in their marriage. But with their marriage over, it seems like it'd be really awkward. You know, I feel like one of them should get custody of Jason in the divorce. And if Jason is crawling into bed with Carly at some point in the next few weeks, then it's clear his loyalties lie with Sonny's ex. And that would be weird if he was working with Sonny, right? But then again, he's been working with Sonny for so long, so it'd be really strange. So, yeah, if they are going to re- reunite Carly and Jason, that leaves the whole thing with Sonny very much up in the air. My second question, will Jason go legit If he gets with Carly or keep on doing dodgy things, you know, Carly has tolerated the mob in her life and kept the secret she was supposed to, for the most part, like years and years ago, she pulled a stunt. I think this was back when like her dad was still alive, her bio dad. She pulled this stunt to try and get Sonny out of the mob and into witness protection. And that blew up and it split them for a while. Bobby was involved in it anyway. And Roy DeLuca, I think. Since then, Carly just accepts Sonny's always going to be a criminal. I mean, heck, she and Jason were running Sonny's mob outfit while he was living as Mike up in Nixon Falls falling for Nina. So Carly has been a mob mall herself. But since the mob powers in town are Selena Wu and Sonny Corinthos, would Jason work for one of them, start his own criminal enterprises, or just get out of crime altogether? That would be great if he would just get out of it. He's clear got some tie to Jagger Cates. That's still all coming out. Maybe Jason could keep doing undercover work, but without being blackmailed into it. I don't know. Steve Burton played an ex-Special Forces guy turned police detective on Young and the Restless years ago. And right now he is still appearing on Days of Our Lives because they filmed six months ahead as an ex-Navy SEAL 
turned police detective. So is GH going to hop on the Burton plays a cop really well bandwagon and have Jason be an ex mob enforcer turned undercover investigator? Nah, stranger things have happened. My third question, will Carly and Jason get married again if they reunite? So, you know, if they get serious, would they walk down the aisle again? The last time they got married, it started as a mob marriage of convenience and then turned into a real marriage of love and affection somewhere along the way. I know a lot of people have said here in soap social media, they never had a real romance. And for the bulk of their time on General Hospital, yes, that is true. They were mostly this dysfunctional friendship where Jason enabled Carly no matter what shenanigans she got herself into. He defended her, stood by her no matter what, cleaned up her messes, and Carly stood by Jason too. It was a two-way street, but after Sonny supposedly died, going over the bridge after Julian, they grieved together. Then they turned to each other. Everything heated up. And by the time they said, I do, they both had admitted to long hidden feelings for each other and said, I love you. It was real when they became man and wife. And then before Jason could get her out of that wedding dress and into bed, which they were about to do, they were about to do the deed, consummate the marriage, all that, Sonny walked in. And that was that, that invalidated their marriage for people asking about that. No, she was never legally married to Jason because she was never, never legally divorced from Sonny and he wasn't legally dead. So, and then Jason was killed off because of the Burton and Bax thing. Anyway, would they get married again? Maybe, I mean, not next week, not next month, maybe not even next year, but at some point, if their relationship really takes off, then yeah, I could totally see them walking down the aisle. Again, it would be pretty funny if Sonny was the best man and Sam was her maid of honor. I would laugh long and hard at that. All right, number four, next question. Will Drew pursue revenge on them if Carly hooks up with Jason. Another thing to consider with any reunion between these two is how his butthurt twin brother would handle it. Drew didn't even wait for Carly to get any closer to Jason. He just preemptively dumped her, fired her from Crimson, although I'm pretty sure she already quit that job. Um, either way, you know, he is done with her personally and professionally because Drew saw the writing on the wall when Jason came back. Now, Drew suspects Carly will stand by Jason and defend him. And yeah, that's definitely happening. And him theorizing that is one thing, but actually watching it happen is another. I'm already worried he might be the one to alert the cops that he thinks his brother's hiding on Quartermain property. Jagger is at the Quartermain mansion on Tuesday and BLQ choose him a new one. So we could have Jason busted by the end of Tuesday's episode. We'll see. I really, really hope Drew doesn't drop a dime on his twin, but it is possible. And he could make the excuse that, oh, well, you know, I, I really thought he shot Dante. And Drew does really think that he shot Dante. Carly's adamant he did not. But if Carly and Jason do start dating, will Drew lose it and act out against them? Yeah, I could totally see him doing that. They've been taking him, you know, from Drew to Drewfus over the past few months, paving the way for Jason and Carly is what it looks like to me. Looks like to me. So, I mean, who even knows how crazy they will make Cameron Matheson's character before all is said and done. One last question. Would Carly and Jason make a baby? <laughs> Would they actually go there? Would we get a Jarly baby? Never say never. I mean, Carly had Donna a few years ago four years ago, back in 2020. So yeah, they could do it again with Jason this time. Not that he needs any more kids that he's not spending time with, you know, unless he's been shot and needs them to get him a first aid kit. I think a Carly Jason baby would be way over the top, you know, but it's a question that needed asking. Wedding, sure. Baby plans, please no, don't go there. Neither of them needs more kids, but we will see how it goes. Let me know what you think could be the fallout from a Carly and Jason reunion and let me know if you're for it or against it. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Definitely drop your comments on this and come back soon. We are here talking General Hospital seven days a week. And as always, it's Belinda from Soap Dirt. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast. 
because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcast, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. <laughs>